back oh, again. Yeah. Hi, Ebony Hayes Inc. and Model Tari. And this episode is about the Brazilian blowout that Model Tari's got right now. She wanted <laughs> to share her dramatic experience <laughs> with you all. Yeah, dramatic. the reason being is because I would not recommend it to anyone. I love the results, <laughs> but the experience I had, I would not recommend it to anyone. And why is that, Model Tari? <laughs> <laughs> okay, although and the woman me assured me there was no chemicals in it, and she just said it was just keratin, it actually burnt my head like it was a relaxer. Really? Yeah. It, it was that actually it was it worse than a relaxer. Wow. And my whole head felt like it was burning. It was it had flames on top of it. One. <laughs> and. No, that's um, a lot. That's that a is, lot. It is a lot. And two, the amount of time she had to straighten it and um, blow dry it, the heat, no lie, the heat felt like it was burning my head on top of the chemical that she said there was no chemical. <laughs> what was it that they put in your head? She said it was a keratin treatment. I heard it's formaldehyde. Well, she, she was adamant that that was not present in it. Uh, but That must be illegal, I said. That must be illegal. No, I done my research. Okay, they don't have concerns with that chemical in in the product for the people using the product because how they're looking at it is that no an individual is not going to use that product more than twice a year. They got concerns about the hairdressers putting it on the person's hair because imagine now they have a hundred different customers wanting the um, Brazilian blowout. They're the ones that's going to be um, consuming. Um, the chemical over and over and over and over again. So the um, what are they called? The what? The health. The watchboard. Is it the health watchboard? Oh, I, yeah. I can't remember the exact name, but they don't have concerns with say people like um, you and me getting um, the Brazilian blowout. But through my experience and it burning on my head, I I would recommend that you don't go for it. So how long does it last? Okay, the woman said it lasts up to six months. Wow, that's the perm. But <laughs> mm, it, mine's already started to. Um, my hair's starting to thicken up. My um, my frizz, <laughs> my frizz is starting to come back. And how long's it been so far? Is it three weeks? Three or four weeks. Okay. So I'm already seeing um, my hair going back to normal. Well, I think six months is a lie. I think six months. How can the hair say it's not chemically relaxed? How can it stay straight exactly. for six months? Exactly. But my, you know, my Asian friend blow dries her hair and doesn't last that long. Um, how I mean, long does it last? Brazilian break. I think it's about three, not even three months. No. And not. she says it doesn't last because my hair's so curly. Well, no. If it doesn't last on hers, why is it gonna last on yours? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it, it did not. Well, it's still there slightly, but I can see it's not gonna last even. Two months, but I'm which I'm happy about. And um, how much was that? Oh, a lot of money, man. <laughs> lot, it was an arm and a leg. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it was an arm and a leg. Really? Was it over a one? No, it wasn't over a one. But it was an arm and a leg. I wouldn't want to pay for that. Like you can go and buy a perm for five pounds. You know what I mean? <laughs> and then you gotta go and get this thing that doesn't last. It's not permanent. And, and yet you still pain. got the same effects. Did, it, did you get scabs? Yeah, I got, uh, no lie, my whole head was a big scab. <laughs> no lie. The scab the scab on my head was this thick, and then each time I... It had thick? It was this thick. This thick? Yeah, all over my scalp. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even funny. It wasn't a good experience. It was not a good experience. And then I went to the doctors, yeah, because I wasn't feeling well. I wasn't feeling well. <laughs> <laughs> Stop laughing, man. And the doctor said, "Have you had a reaction in the scalp? Because my lymph, my lymph nodes—is that what they're called? Lymph nodes? Yeah, lymph glands. Oh, lymph glands, yeah. Um, had swelled up like triple the size, all behind my ears. And then she, and the, uh, um, the doctor said to me that, um, that's a consequence of an infection in your head. <laughs> in your head. <laughs> Sorry." <laughs> Bearing in mind, this girl is the most sensitive person you'll ever meet. Anything that touches her skin, anything she eats, 
Anything she does in life, walks, breathes, yeah, she gets a reaction to. She's allergic to everything, but she likes to do all these experiments <laughs> with all these different chemicals and all these different things. No, because it's, it's meant to be a natural chemical, reacts. though. It's meant to no, be a natural chemical. No, but considering you're so sensitive to everything, everything. Well, well, life isn't fair, though. Why is it? Because I, I react to things. I can't try things. I will try them. Well, you're you never keep know. reacting, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> but that's put me off, man. That's put me off. Yeah, it's, it's definitely put, it's put me out too. I saw them do it one time on the YouTube thing, but I didn't yeah. get to see the chemical that they put in their hair. But the result was like, wow. The results, I loved woo. the results. The only thing I didn't like with the results is I lost a bit of volume. But apart from flat. that, hmm? it went flat. Yeah, it went flat. But apart from that, my volume came back after after two weeks, I'd say. Okay, that's cool. All right. So all in all, you'd say Brazilian blowout was a no, no. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Definitely, no, no. Well, I say. <laughs> cool. I say, do your research. Um, you know, I I looked on as many different YouTube videos, and actually, a lot of them did say the same thing I I'm saying. <laughs> but it wasn't, bad. Yeah, yeah, but it wasn't as bad. Yeah, but it wasn't as bad though. It wasn't as bad. No one said that they had big scabs. Yeah, but well, no one, maybe no one's a hypersensitive like you. All they said is that all they said is that it did burn their scalp a little bit and it was like relaxer, but I'd say it was ten times worse than relaxer. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna know honestly. Oh, well, it, it was worse than giving birth. It was worse worse than giving birth. I'm sorry for I don't feel your pain. And, and I'm sorry for your pain. I'm no sorry. well well, thank you, but you know what, at the end of the day I'd sat in that chair and I didn't walk out of the shop. <laughs> what do you mean, so you know, it's my own fault. It is my own fault. The thing is, I thought you know, it might get no better. means no. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, anyway, let's round it up. Yep. Brazilian blowout, no. Is a no no. I I suggest you don't even go there. Alright, bless. <laughs> <laughs>